Oh, what's going on? Welcome back to Rosecott Gaming. This is your boy Sonny, and we are back with some more FIFA 17 tips and tricks. And this is how to get loads of money in FIFA 17 career mode. What you want to do is start a brand new career mode to start off with. Go to manager career, put, put in all your information, whatever you want to do, and pick yourself a team. Okay, so once you've picked your team, as you can see, we've started a brand new career mode with Barnsley. You want to go to transfers, you want to go to sell players. Now, you, what you're going to do is actually go to age and see who's the oldest out of your players who hasn't reached recently joined the club so you've got Hamill there we've also got Roberts is he no he hasn't recently joined the club we've got Hurrihan and we've got Winall as well we're gonna use these th these four players even for the purposes of the video but you can do it to as many as you want just don't go past the age of 25 you don't want them being there for your whole career mode so once you've done that you want to back straight out of that career mode you want to go to customize using the RB button or the R1 button if you're on PS4 then go to edit player this is what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and choose the team that we chose for the career mode as you can see we've got win there we've got Williams there these are the kind of players we're gonna edit we're just gonna go to categories go to attack put their attack up all right put their attack up whatever position they played which is a center forward he's got he needs attack we're gonna put it up so it increases his overall stats come on you can put it up to 93 if you don't want him to go too much so you want him to be affordable plus you want him to be not too good so you want to put the stats up there, maybe around the 90 to 95 overall, and then hopefully he goes for quite a bit of Moolah. And the first time that we actually started the career mode was just to scout out who has recently joined there, who has a, who's on loan and who isn't. The worst thing you can do is make a loan player good, and then the loan player goes back to their club, they make the money, and then obviously they're making money in their club instead of you making money in your club. So we're going to go ahead and do it to the rest of these players, and then I'll see you guys in a second. Now that that's done, you want to back out of the customized menu, and you want to go to play career and you're gonna start a brand new career mode like I said the first time you actually made the career mode was just to make sure the players that you're bringing in isn't or the players that you're editing isn't the players that are gonna leave in the first season from finishing their loan or something like that and then with squads used you want to go to current customize don't go to download latest download the latest before you do this if you want to do it as a career mode and then you can download the latest again once you've started and saved the career mode so what you want to do is advance with the current customized squads and then I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we've started a brand new career. Well, what I'm going to do is just show you guys our transfer budget. We've got three million pounds in our transfer budget. Now what we want to do is go back to the transfer menu. We want to go to sell players. We're going to put it on the age because that's where they came in. Is right at the top. And as you can see, Hamill there, 85 overall, worth 27 million. We can add him to the transfer list or we can wait for the offer to come in. Winnow, worth 49 million. Imagine if we made their stats even better, they'd be worth even more money. We're just going to put these on now. Bang, bang, and bang. That's four players right there. He's going to make us around the 100 million mark. Even more than 100 million even. And I haven't even made their stats the best. I've only made an 83, 85, 85, and an 88 out of them. We could have made them even better. Transfer offer in for Hurrihan, just as I expected. We could either counter offer this for around the 40 to 50 million mark or just accept it. I'm going to accept them for the purposes of the video, but you can counter offer and make even more money. Transfer offer in for Mark Roberts, just as we expected. Like I said, we could offer them 27.5 million as a counter offer instead of just accepting them straight away. Player sold, get the hell out of here. Oh, another transfer offer. What do you know? This time for Sam Winnell, they're coming with 27 million. We're going to say 65 million for the 49, value, 49 million valued midfielder. Transfer offer. Okay, they come back with 23 million. Not bad. Bang. We're making more meal land. Just like that. Bang, bang, boogie. Transfer offering for Adam Hamill. We're going to go ahead and accept that, just for the purposes of the video. No more counter-offering. Oh, they don't believe it's worth that much. Okay, then. Get out of here, United. We'll wait for a new offer. Don't worry. Player sold. Get out of here. Player sold. Get out of here. Oh, another offer for Sam Winnell. What do you know? 39 million this time from Arsenal. Bang. Just like that, we're going to accept it. I know he's worth 49 million. We could counter-offer for way more than that. Probably around 70 to 80 million. But we're going to take it just for the purposes of the video. And last but not least, player sold. Sam Riddle to Arsenal for 39 million. Now, if we go to our office, oh, what's that then? 95 million. In fact, if we go ahead and put it all the way to the right, 101 million pounds from four players from three million pounds. We've just made 98 million, 90, 94 million, 95 million, near enough. 95 million pound profit. 
not bad. And if you think he's all sunny, we just lost some of our greatest players though. Go ahead and put bids in for Marcus Rashford. Go ahead and put bids in for Sergio Aguero if you really want to. Ia Nacho if you want to. Walkins, whoever that is. Clayton, Danny Ings, Andre Gray, whoever you want to buy to replace them, go ahead and put the bids in. It just doesn't really matter to me. It matters to you though. I know it matters to you, don't worry. But you can replace them with literally about 10 million pounds for young beasts. Don't worry about it. And then you've got 85 million profit. Just like that. Bang, bang, buggy. Just like that. I told you this is how to get loads of money in career mode. If you've enjoyed the video, smash that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I'm sorry I didn't stream today. It's just I've lost track of time. I'm really, really sorry. But I do update you guys on Twitter. If you haven't followed me on Twitter, it's in the description below. Also, my tech reviews channel is also in the description below. I'll be give doing giveaways with like gaming headsets and stuff like that that's in the description below go ahead and subscribe to that but for now it has been me you guys have been great and i'm out peace